Hello again. Interesting one today. Got a lovely Ducati Multistrada for a full service with belts. So, in traditional superbike surgery style, got everything laid out. People seem to think that there is some magical black art in adjusting a cam belt. Everybody gets a little bit excited about whether they're done correctly and whatnot. It really is the simplest job in the world. I'm going to take these belts off now and then I'll give you a little bit of a how to show you how I tension them. These eight valve motors are basically the way you position the engine to refit the new belts. These aren't the new belts by the way, these are still the second hand ones. But there's a mark here on the crankcase um, that lines up with this pulley and then there's marks uh, where are we? there's a mark here on the cylinder head um, and a punch mark on the sprocket here and uh, line those marks up and the same on the top mark on the cam cover here punch mark when this is all lined up, this is actually top dead centre on number one cylinder. I've got a little tool in here for turning the uh, crankshaft, but through that hole there, you might not be able to see. No, you can't. There's a punch mark that lines up, and that's top dead centre on the front cylinder. Um, so that's where you position the engine, ready to take the belts off and fit the new ones. Okay, here we are then. The new belts are fitted as you can see, uh, now it's going to be a case of adjusting them. Uh, as I said earlier on, it's going to be um, as close to 110 hertz as you can get, but 5 hertz either side is going to be absolutely fine. Um, you do this by strumming the uh, cam belt with your finger while placing your little microphone jobby next to the cam belt, and this gives you a frequency reading. So all you do is you get your finger and you strum the belt like that and then measure the frequency. Um, and as I say, it should be between 115 and 105 hertz. Um, you must make sure, however, that the cylinder you're adjusting is at top dead center. So you'll need to turn the engine from uh, the position we've got it now, top dead center on the front, turn it 90 degrees to get top dead center on the rear cylinder. And this is because there are actually some valve springs in there that just hold the valve shut while the engine's starting because the Desmotronic valve gear on its own there is some uh, clearance in the valves and the valves would actually leak when you were trying to start it. So this isn't a how-to but hopefully that gives you a bit of an idea of uh, what goes on. As you can see from this diagram from the vertical line and the dialog box at the top you've uh, measured the belt tension at 105 Hz which is uh, perfect for a Ducati as I said earlier on the measurement needs to be anywhere between 115 and 105 so this is absolutely spot on thanks for watching see you soon